Broski, what's a puppet? It's a meat joke. And today I'm going to explain to you guys how to prevent cravings, bro. People having cravings all the time and this is why they not succeed in their diet. Okay? And then they ask me, Joe, how do you deal with these cravings? How do you do it? How do you manage to stay shredded all year round? And I'm like, bro, no worries. I got your back, man. Because I know how to deal with the cravings. You just need to give yourself a little treat like I do with, for instance, I'm having this hot chocolate here. Could also be an iced coffee. With a total of 60 calories. It's one liter of hot chocolate, sweet AF, and it has 60 calories. How is that gonna happen? Bro, first of all, I mean, this is pro tip number one, hot chocolate. Natural chocolate powder is, has one spoon, has like 10 calories. You can eat one spoon hot chocolate and then put artificial sweetness. Or you have some natural sweetness, I don't know. So you need to give yourself something to just satisfy this feeling. It's feelings, feeling hungry, getting your cravings. This is all these kind of emotions and feelings that you have to deal with in your diet in order to succeed. So when these cravings come up and you're like, holy moly, and then before you go to the fridge and you start to binge eat a lot, just like I do, make a hot chocolate for yourself. Or drink tea. This is also what I do. I'm making a lot of tea, you know. Jasmine tea, peppermint tea, New York chai tea, warm tea, then I put the sweetener in. Then I either at night I can drink a hot tea, iced tea, I put the sweetener in. And then all the time when you feel like you're watching TV, mostly people watch TV or they do something on their phone or their computer or their laptop. And then without thinking even, they sit there and they're eating something. They're watching the content and then they're stuffing themselves. And then until they're in, then one point they realize like, holy moly, what did I do? I just ate a burger with some fries. But instead of ordering a burger with fries, you know what you're going to do from next, from now on, bro? You're going to cut cucumber, you're going to take veggies, okay? Or you should drink a lot. Then now, this sounds actually really weird, but it helps to prevent cravings and helps to succeed in your diet. And also it helps you to drink enough. Every time you go to pee, after this, you go and you drink one big glass of warm water, bro. Warm water, trust me. This sounds weird, I know, but try it yourself. Every time when you went to the toilet afterwards, straight away, wash your hands, of course, my friend, and then take a glass of hot water and drink that one. So you just, not instantly, just you peed out, you refilled even something, okay? It's always about your body is giving you the signal of like he wants something, okay? But instead of eating chocolate, why not just sipping something like sweet chocolate, like my, I do with my hot chocolate, 60 calories, one liter, sit there, satisfying AF. Or why wouldn't you eat some Snickers bar and why wouldn't you not just cut some cucumber or carrot or some low caloric veggies or something that is low in calories and eat that instead. These treats like giving yourself the sugar all the time that makes insulin spike and then you want you crave for more. People now will argument with me and they say, yeah, but the sweeteners, the sweeteners are really bad, bro. And they cause even more cravings. And I'm like, no, I'm using sweeteners all the time, bro. I'm using, I use sweeteners when I was the most stressed in my life. They do not retain water, they not hold water, they not make you have more cravings. No, it's BS, man, it's just lies. So number one tip for me, drink something. I don't care what is it. Then also there's this, one second. I'm, I'm, for instance, I'm using almond milk a lot, okay? This one has 200 milliliters, also 60 calories. Then I have an unsweetened almond milk, 180 milliliters, 25 calories only, you know? So you can have 50 calories, then you put this on top, 10 calories, one tablespoon. Then you put the sweetener inside. All of a sudden you're having like this, a hot chocolate with 60 calories, man. Okay, good. And if you don't like hot chocolate, then you just take something else. Then you can make a peppermint tea for yourself or a ginger tea. I don't know what kind of thing. You get the point? You have to satisfy, how can I say it? You have to give your body something. He's asking you for sweets and you're giving him something instead. If you not give yourself something when your body's asking for it, you're holding it back. You're holding back this emotion. You're holding back today and tomorrow and in three days you're going to break out and then you binge all night long and then you look like because... So instead of you not allowing yourself to eat something sweet, give yourself a little sweet every day, bro, okay? It helps you so much because it doesn't matter. As long as you count the calories into your daily calories burned or intake, it's okay. 
You can eat whatever you want as long as it fits your macros. Okay, bro? And if you're having problems with these cravings at night, tea, hot tea, cold tea, chocolate, hot chocolate, cold chocolate, zero drinks. I don't know, man. Zero drinks. Zero iced tea, zero Coke, zero Sprite, zero Fanta. I don't know what you have. Just try to do this. And I swear to God, I'm always drinking. This is why I'm, I'm drinking so much. And this is why I'm always having something sweet with me. Because here I have Sprite Zero. Then I have my Zero hot chocolate. Then I have my sweetener here. Then whatever I'm doing, I make it sweet. I like sweet so much, bro. So I can't live without these artificial sweeteners, okay? And instead of having the real sugar, that's also not healthy for you, bro. So you have to make a choice anyways, right? Give yourself some treats and every day it will not bother you, bro. Just take care of the overall calories intake. Yeah? And if you're still having problems at night with these cravings, I swear to God, just try it. Cut some... This thing is always... The problem is mostly that once you have these cravings, maybe you're not, you're not having something around. Maybe the easiest choice is just to go to the next um, gas station and buy some Snickers bars or sweets bars, okay? But instead of doing this, bro, you can also go there and buy something like, I don't know, Sprite Zero. You understand? Just always try to talk yourself into this. What is more important to you? You have to ask yourself, what do you want? Do you want to eat? Do you want to look good? Do you want to still eat and still look good? Then be smart. Get the knowledge in how you can also eat and have sweets every day and still have a successful diet. And then if you can control yourself, I swear to God, with these hot chocolates, man, I mean, what am I even talking about? This is the same shit all the time, man. You have cravings, drink something. You have cravings, eat something very low calories. Good? Good, thank you that we have finally talked about this, bro. I mean, I'm just upset about myself that I'm so stupid and I always forget what I wanted to say. This is why I'm going to stop the video now, because I'm just too stupid. No, I don't have a whiteboard or something here that I can show you, like, this is what you should do. No, I did not write down anything. I'm sorry, man. I'm making these videos out of my fucking intention, okay? If you're not happy with the content, then just please don't watch it, man. Okay, one second. I have to bring this in. Because it's really hard, bro, not to try to sell you some shit. It's real, man. I'm not trying to sell you something. I'm just trying to give you my personal opinion on these things, okay? This is it. I don't want to try to sell you like, you have cravings? Take these pills, brother. They will help you for every craving that you have. You never need anything else. Just take my pills. Buy my products. I don't need to sell you anything, man. That's the thing. And if you do not appreciate that I make these videos, I should stop, man. I just, just should stop because people are just complaining too much. I mean, I don't get it. I just don't understand, man. I just, I mean, I don't even want to think about it anymore. Adios, amigos. Have a nice one. I don't know when you're watching, bro. But don't be a bitch and stick to your diet, please. You can do it if you really want. How important is it to you? Ask yourself. If it's important enough, you will find a way to make it happen.